okay, we we back. Uh, we came here Monday. This you know November is here. You know, thank God for November because um, October was just a a, a downright mess. And but um, well, I'm not gonna blame it on October. It's just the market reacting to wars and um, inflation and everything out. The market was just reaction. But November seemed that I I thought so because every year, um, you know, November is one of those. October is one of those months. That, and then it comes November. November is when they get they get a little sanity. It's getting close to Christmas time, Thanksgiving. Uh, I know it's a war going on, and um, you know, just pray for Israel and, uh, and uh, just 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 pray for peace. But um, you know, I will leave that alone. This is not. I, I you know, I'm, I'm an Israel man, always been, and will always be. You know. Uh, Israel God, that's it. So we enough of that. We we gonna go back to um my my sidekick. You know, she's sitting over there waiting. She said, "What's going on with your stock?" So we go we gonna share our screen because I'm I'm, I'm gonna do uh, I'm gonna do what we do. We gonna share our screen, and um first of all, I'm gonna go to my tool. Okay. If you don't mind, I, I'm, I'm gonna go into this LLAP because LLP, I got a 64 that I bought. I went in and bought about a total of 12,000, which gave me an average of about 77, 78 cents a, a share. Right now it's running about in the 90s and it should be, it, 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 you know, it just got a boost, it, uh, upgrade. It's gonna be like $6, but it's really, they, they saying it's 96%. This is what the tool is saying, but analysts are saying, you know, they raised it, most of the analysts are saying $6. But right now, it's still only, it's less than a dollar. So, uh, it said earnings expected to grow, forecast to grow 60, 76 cents. Uh, 76% negative shareholder equity, significant insider selling over the last three months, and has been uh, less than one year cash volatile share price over the last three months. Okay. Okay, and then it got more risk, but we're not going to get into that. You you know, you need to understand that this is my one of my favorites right now, because it's 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 satellites and satellites big. See now it's starting to it's starting to go. So if it gets here, we 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 really and this was back in um, March or April of this year. Then it started downward trend, you know, you know, dollar and something, and then it hit boom, you know. Um, price target increase, okay? Price target. This is what I was telling you about. By increased by thirteen percent, uh, because they got a couple of contracts now, uh, you know, from one from European space people, and then Lockheed gave them seven hundred million. I said that last time. And the company is forecast to post a net loss. And that's, you know, that's the Zach and company, you know. But I'm going to close this out. But, you know, this, keep it out. Last seven days, it's been up six. Overall, 65% loss for the year. Um, You know, about the company. And we already talked about the company. Price to sell. It's good stock value. Uh, It's down here. Okay. It's price to sales a good, you know. I got a low flow, so it can it can take off. Now I'm saying it should be about twenty five dollars a share. I'm thinking more lines. First of all, about thirty dollars a share. Now they moved it down. Fair share about twenty five. Currently, it's about eight nine cents. I'm saying today it's in the nineties. Let's see if it can yeah, stay there when we get back to it. You know. Um. You can see all the good things. Future growth is good. Company versus industry and as far as growth. Equity. Okay. Free cash. Balance sheet health. Assets, liability. I still think it's going to get Somebody gonna buy it out. You can because look at it. It's got negative equity, negative shareholder equity, which is more serious than a high debt level. And then the debt, they got a lot of debt, and they I think they get ready to get rid of the CEO because he made he makes some foolish decisions, and this stock should be no no more less than three dollars a share. 
and he, you know, his name Mark Bell, you know, he, he makes seven point seven million dollars. Okay, figure that seven point seven million dollars. It's ten years been there about two points, and then you know you can see what has been going down since he's been there. Um, experience board, and these are the people who sell it. It's been selling off. He's Peach Point has been selling off a lot of shares. So nobody's really coming in and buying at this point but me. <laughs> but look, they got institutions on them. That's what I told my son. They got a lot of institutions on them. Individual insiders, hedge funds, is more general public only 34. But if you look at all these folks, we own most of it. You know, institutions, hedge funds, public companies, private companies. And these are your big boys, Lockheed. 13, 15 million. Mark's Bell, he got 12 million shares. So even if you say we get rid of me, I got 12 million shares. So his shares worth about $9 million. So he, he's good. He said, I'm good to go. Whether you keep me or, or fire me, he said, I'm, I'm good. I'm going to keep my shares because it's going to block where I got about 5 million of them. They went in and got some more. You know, They increased their position Okay, by 94%. So look, look, come on, Vanguard increased it by five percent. So they saying, uh oh, something's about to go, something about to blow, something about to blow, something about to blow. Uh, Bank of America, they they in this this. You know, look at all Merrill Lynch, Beach Point. You know, they they've been selling out. I guess they said they they tired of being in the negative. They they took some of their money, but they still got six million. Okay, still got six million. So we're going to leave that alone. We got about 11 minutes to go. So you can see what's going on with LLAMP because I think they're going to be one of the winners today. They got a lot of winners out there. So let's, let's uh, reshare our screen and go into the market. I'm going to start looking at my personal, for the personal stuff first. Okay, this is my personal side. And you can see I'm starting, I put some more money in there, you know, um, I put I took two, you know, two more thousand of my personal money because I said I want to get into some, I want to buy more shares of some of these others. Like this one right here, Lyft, you know, made me about two thousand dollars. I took two thousand dollars out, it made me two thousand. So I came back in and bought three hundred of the profit. Uh so I took of the two thousand I made, I went ahead and um uh, bought back in. Uh, 300 of the 2000. So I only made about 12, $1,300, which is good. So right now, you know, I'm making still a little more. They got earnings come Monday. Then I can take it out anytime. But I, I want, I like this one. This one is owned by a lot of institutions. I think I did a little spread on this one. If not, this one got earnings too. So this is like in, in um, you know, phase three. I think this is one of my uh, uh, stocks that I just picked up. But, you know, it's not doing too well now. But I'm going to keep my See, This right here is this one going back and forth. And I, I'm not, you know, I'm not worried about it. I picked up more shares here. You know, I doubled my shares here because this one, uh, SID, I'm going to highlight that come Monday because they had, they got two, con they got contracts, two contracts, one yesterday and date, one today. So, I ain't worried about that one anymore. I was worried about that one, but I think uh, earnings are going to come this month. Plus, I think they're going to get another contract. And when it does, it's going to blow this one out, blow the roof. Uh, uh, psychedelics and all them guys, you got to blow the roof. Blow the roof. You know, and we're going to see what happens. But that you know, that's, the, that's, the, that's the risk. I'm taking the risks on this one right here. You know, because this one is not, look like it's not doing too well. I got a 948, it's 92 something. Uh, and then I got a 10 something on the other end. So it's really all together. I got about 90,000 shares and I might get about 10,000 more, make it a hundred thousand. If it stays in the nine come Monday, I might even put some more of my money into it because I think this one, this one, if it goes up to uh, a couple of dollars, you know, you, you didn't, you didn't earn your law, your losses back. So I'm going to leave this one on. See, this one keeps going back and forth. So you, this, you, you, you can't count these these folk out. These two right here, I'm just waiting on TTO. To, you know, they got earnings. And then I'm keeping I'm keeping 100 on TTO because they got that FDA, that um, 
it's in the FDA right now. They want an emergency to come out. And this one, this one might blow. So I, I'm trying to keep a little money on side just in case it does. I, that's why I say I have to put more money in this thing. Um, and I picked up some big boys uh, too. These guys right here, we'll see what the earnings hold for us next week. Uh, the market is just, you know, yeah, it had some good news all week. So you can see it's been blowing. Okay, let's go to my other one. This one right here is, is, the, is the biggie right here. Um, this is my business account. I went back SIC. I've been getting SID. I I got six six thousand uh shares on this one, pretty well. And this in the green, it's starting to get in the green, starting to go down. So, uh, this is one uh up here. Even though Apple had good good earnings, they you know people. I told you, market is fickle. Uh, they could look at the future and say, okay, we, we, we got a handle on this thing. So that's why, but it was 172 this morning. Now it's back up to 176. So I'm pretty, I'm pretty confident that that's, they're going to get it right. Amazon has been Amazon. Amazon been going up ever since earnings. So I got 30 overall on them. Um, this one right here, I'll keep my seat and ground on this one too, because this one is good. I think it's the, uh, a medical stock, but it's on phase three. And you can see the, this one can pop. This is 10 cents. So I said, I, I got to keep my seed in the ground on this one. You know, um, I might, yeah, I might have, let, let me let me buy about a thousand dollars more, this a thousand shares more. Okay. It's only 10 cents. So I'm going to go ahead and get another uh, uh, 10 cents on this. It's only a hundred. Let, let me put about 200, uh, let me, let me get three thousand. Something about this stock. Let me let me get about um, uh, two thousand. Okay, uh, it may not, but uh, I'm going. I'm I'm going. Uh, uh, let, let's see if I can pick this one up. See if I can catch it. It's only two hundred dollars, three hundred dollars. I made some money. It's okay, so. We back. Well, let's, let's see. It's got earnings come Monday, so we're gonna see what happens. If it don't do anything with earnings, you know, I, I lost about three hundred, but I, three hundred you can lose. I don't plan on losing anything because I think this one gonna blow too, and I can always pull my thousand shares out when it gets. If it blows up to about twenty, thirty, forty cents, I'd have made a little money. Right now, it's not making any money. Then you got the CMG. I got five, six minutes. And that, 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 you know, people say, why don't you just take these things out? Nope. I'm going to keep it there. It's been almost a year. I'm going to keep it until March of next year. That's when I pick these up. March. I pick HCM at last March. So next March in 2024, if they ain't doing that, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and sell them. You know, this one got 110, you know, HCMC, and it's got earnings this month. So they waiting on a lawsuit, some tobacco lawsuit on their thing, but they not they into the home the healthy choice. So this is hundred got hundred million people volume, but this at one cent. So I leave that alone. Intel has been burning up the charts now. You know, thirty four. I, I bought it thirty four and look at it, it's thirty eight. I, I like Intel. I like I like Intel what they're doing. They had good earnings too. And they 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 behind the video and AMD, but Intel, I, I'm hearing he whisper again to me. Intel, Intel said, "I'm getting my position back. I want everybody in the Intel again." So I, if Intel can go. Uh, I know Nvidia got it going on, but Intel's in the, I, the AI too. So LLAP, look at that, ninety four. Okay, this we had got as high as ninety six today. That's why I say, that, you remember the one I just showed, LLAP? I got twelve thousand shares at seventy eight. Okay, so I got you know right now you know it's it's still it's over ninety. It was eighty. It was eighty nine yesterday. Now it's ninety four. I got I got a feeling you know, next week they're gonna have earnings. If week or next, I think it's next week they're gonna have earnings next week too. They haven't advertised it, but they gonna have they gonna have to show something. They gonna have to show the show. You know they had um okay Microsoft. Okay, Microsoft been burning up since they had good earnings. They had no three fifty two. They should be about three seventy. I, I, I said, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and bite. I'm, I'm gonna keep Microsoft. Microsoft, you know, you can't go wrong. They're gonna be they they're gonna be blowing up the chart. Everybody got Microsoft. <laughs> Everybody got Microsoft, and they're not in AI and Bing and all this other stuff. 
So they will fit. So look, look, they made me a little money. They got 18 million people on. Then you got, uh-oh, Palatar had good earnings yesterday. So I got, I always had, I got them at 15. And uh, they had 18. They should be in the 20. So I'm a key. And they got 103 folk on there, 103 million people coming out of for Palatar. Palatar got it going. Palatar. You, you got it going. I got to give it to you. And SAVA, even though they had some bad news, they got earnings, I think, it's next week, but it's unconfirmed. Um, they, you know, they went up. Remember, they went down. I took them when they went down, $11. Now they back up to $20. You got, got over $1,000. I can snatch it out right now. And they probably, I, it's, they, I'm, I'm keeping my seed in the ground because this one, this one get FDA rule in their favor. Boy, this one's gonna be about two, three hundred dollars share. So I'm, I, I'm with you, SAVA. I'm still with you. I still got, I still get, still got. This one right here is the big one. This is the one I keep telling you. This is the one. Uh, I'm waiting for this one to blow. I got ninety thousand overall, ninety thousand shares on this one. Okay, and this one, you know, this week it was like four thousand. Okay, if 4,000 people, 400,000, now it's got 6 million people. Because they know something big is about to happen. They got two contracts, I keep telling you, they got two this week. And this is a woman owned company. And this is only nine cents. <laughs> it was 17 when I first bought it. That's why I lost about two, three thousand dollars on this one alone this year. This is my profit has been in this one right here. So we're going to see what happens to this one. I don't care what they do, uh, but uh, I'm. I got about say this is a lot of money, six thousand dollars, and overall I got about nine thousand dollars on this thing. So uh, I'm not I'm not about betting the whole thing on it, but I you know not investing the whole thing on it. That's why I got a little you know AT and T. AT and T is starting to wake up. You know it's fourteen and now it's fifteen. Okay, I got two hundred shares on AT T Tesla. Tesla, you know, we've been counting Tesla out all week. They went as, as far down as 209 or something, or 208. Now they back up to 219. They said, I'm, I got some AI too, folks. You know, hey, and they coming out with something. Tesla's just not cars. Tesla's got some other things in the making. They in SpaceX, they got uh, electric something, electric, you know, power, grids, and all this other stuff. So don't count these, don't count them out. Look at them, got it back up to 220. Look, look, look at them, they racing. Okay, these other ones are going down. That's why it looks like it's going down. Okay, it's four o'clock. And then we got this last but not least in the next Monday, you know, they have earnings. Okay, see, so you got you to gotta look at this. You know, okay. See, these look at look at these go lab. Okay, they 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 all these guys they waiting on Monday. See what see what's gonna happen. But nine hundred and seven. That's that's pretty good. Uh, I might go ahead and see. Gotta, here we go. Let's look at all of them together. That's not bad. It's not bad. The winner is really LLP. Yeah, LL. Yeah, you can't the, see. That's why I say the winner is still LLAP. Okay. The rest of these, are, they got some, but the clear winner today is LLAP, and that's the one I highlighted. SAVA, that's, you know, uh, SIDU, is Lisa starting to perk back up. Okay. I'm not losing as much. Okay, but uh, keep an eye on, keep an eye on this one right here too. Tesla is not is not through. I got thirty of Tesla. Look, I got some guy, I got some good ones on here, and the earnings are all next week. Let's see, let's see what happens. Let's see if some of these others. Let's see if my HCMC gonna do anything. Okay, I just wanted to show you that. So let me let me stop sharing. Uh, okay, okay, okay. See, see, you see my grand grand. Um, Okay, you got, you got, you got, you got to put a little trust in me. I know you saying yeah, right. And you're playing with my future. I said, uh, you, know, you know, I got a little money stashed away for you. Don't worry about. It. God bless you. God keep you. God cause faith shine on you and give you peace. And uh, we gonna try this again Monday if the Lord will. We are gonna see see what's what's going on. See if it start the downward trend. 
based on this afternoon. And then Monday going to be a reflective of next week, if the Lord will. You know, we got a holiday week coming in. And plus it's, you know, Black Friday. Pretty soon, you got you got all things going. You know, Christmas people starting the Christmas shopping, people start vacation. They could be spending money. This economy right now is hot. You got wars around the world. You got Ukraine. You got Israel. So we we gonna see what's happening. God bless you. God keep you. God call his face shine on you and give you peace. I see. We'll see next week. We're in this thing. Bye bye.